All right, guys, figured I'd do a quick little review video, testing some new audio and video equipment out. Try to make these a little bit better as I move forward. Uh, I've been working on splitting wood and getting my stockpile built up to have enough to use for years rolling forward. And part of that is making sure that what I have split and stored uh, is dry enough that I can burn it without creating any hazardous conditions or cleaning problems in, uh, in my wood stove and my chimney. So that brings me to this handy little guy picked up off Amazon. I will put a link in the description at some point. Uh, got it off of Amazon. Dr. Meter Moisture Gauge. Um, pretty handy little device. Somewhere it came with a couple extra spikes, but basically what, what this does um, is you turn it on, you uh, jam it into a piece of split wood, and it tells you what the moisture level is. Uh, it's my understanding that 20% and below is what you're really looking for. Uh, I'll continue to do more research. Nothing that I'm splitting so far is going to be utilized in my stove. So, that being said, before we move on with this demonstration slash review, we probably need to go procure some split wood. And through the magic of video, we've got just that. Um, you want to test the fresh split piece that you just uh, created, because obviously this this was the existing outside side of this piece. Um, this is probably pretty dry right here. This is where the moisture still is in the wood. And maybe we can demonstrate that if I prove that I'm not wrong. Zeroes out. I gave that a nice little jam in there. And it's showing 36% moisture, pretty stable. Let's check the outside of the piece. We're back down zero. See, we're significantly drier on the outside. Uh, this piece then, as expected, um, this has probably only been sitting split for two or three months. So, be that as it may, here's our new fresh face out of that piece. Give that a nice little jam, or 28%. Outside piece of the piece is uh, 17. I really like that display. Really easy for me to read. But uh, so far, I've been using this sparingly. Obviously, I'm not using it a whole bunch because uh, I know most of what I have is is not ready to be burned yet, but I can kind of track it in this way. Uh, this is just maple got for free. Um, I'll continue to check a piece every couple of months and that'll help me to establish my uh, drying schedule for that type of wood for where I live and I'll just kind of keep rolling uh, through all the different stuff I have that way. So far though, works like it's supposed to. It's relatively inexpensive. Why not have one if you're burning wood? Even if you're buying your wood, I would want to see what the moisture level was before I paid for it. So it might be handy to have around for you guys that are that are wood burners. Let me know what you think, people that have got more experience with it than me, and I will update you guys as I go. Thank you.